So, I wanted to document my solution to getting that ring in. And I hope it stays. But I have a solution, and it's an easy one. So basically, I have the tool to install the ring, but every time I was using it, it wouldn't go in. And so, I came up with a solution. I bought this thing in the plumbing department at uh, Home Depot. And what it is, is you turn it and it opens. That rubber piece opens. So you just turn it and turn it. So what I did is once the bellow was in there, I did put a little bellows adhesive on it to keep it in place. But that ring would not go in no matter what. It kept slipping out, sliding out. And finally, I just came up with this plan to put this in there, compress it, compress the rubber, the bellow, with this thing. So it fits in there perfectly. I had to shave, I had to shave this end down a little to fit in here. But once it goes in there, it fits right between the bellow rubber and I just turned it clockwise until it was fairly tight and I left it in there all night got back today after work pulled this out got my tool put the ring in on, on the tool here and then put that in there like that I took this 2x4 and that's a little 4 pound sledgehammer and tapped it fairly hard not too hard but fairly hard I hit it about 3 or 4 times that way turned the 2x4 that way tapped it in again and voila, pulled this out. That thing is in there. It ain't going nowhere. Super tight. So, that's the trick right there. Home Depot. Grind the front of it off so you'll be able to put it in the housing and then put it between the bellow in the housing so here's my other my old one you're gonna put this thing in there like that and you're gonna turn it and it's gonna expand and it's gonna make that rubber compress and once that rubber compresses you'll be able to get that ring in there and uh, that thing's super tight it ain't going anywhere so that's my solution and it worked. The shift bellows going on. Shift tool. Just put bellows adhesive on the exhaust bellow. And now I'm gonna have this tool hold it in place until it dries. But that's how you get your shift bellow on there, or your exhaust bellow. I'm not really seeing a lot of that on YouTube. Um, it's on there enough. So, there's my bellows adhesive on there. And this is just in place holding it. It's an exhaust bellow tool. There we go. I had to take the shift shaft um, out of the bell housing. I just think that was the easiest way to do that. 
um, the bolt that holds the shift arm onto the shift shaft was seized, so I just took the whole bar out, cut the bar out, and I uh, just put a new bar in there, a new shaft, and a new arm. But getting this bellow on there is pretty easy with the tool. The bellow tool. Anyway, just thought I'd show that.